Hey everybody, this is Bryce with Timberframe HQ. In this short video, we're going to take a look at the five advantages to building a small timberframe home. Now, since the 1970s, the average size of a new home has nearly doubled, from an average of 1,400 square feet to 2,700 square feet. And this is all happening while the number of people in a household continues to drop. Now, while many people think that bigger is better, building a small timber frame home definitely has some advantages. So let's take a look at the first one, lower utility bills. Although newer homes are energy efficient, the cost to heat and cool today's large homes can take a huge bite out of your budget. Aside from the financial considerations, large houses are also using up more and more of their fair share of the natural resources. The second one is fewer repairs and maintenance costs. A small home has fewer items to replace, and what does need to be replaced, such as the roof, flooring, furnaces, and air conditioners, costs less to replace in a small home. Additionally, the amenities that sometimes come with the larger homes, like whirlpool tubs, will require the extra maintenance and repair. So the third one is less clutter. People, including myself, have a tendency to keep accumulating things until they fill up a space they have, no matter how large. A well-planned smaller home will have a practical multi-purpose spaces and will discourage large rooms devoted to one activity. Such rooms are an invitation to collect random paraphernalia, and a smaller home will force you to buy more prudently, which will also save you money. Number four, no more downsizing. Many people discover that they can finally afford a larger home just as their children are leaving the nest. Later they must downsize when they can no longer care for the property or it becomes dangerous for them to get around. A small home built with handicapped facilities or easily convertible floor plan will allow you to stay in your home longer, delaying the need for assistant living or nursing home. Even younger families can benefit from this strategy. The fifth one is overall financial security. If you have a fabulous house but have nothing left after paying the mortgage and property taxes to enjoy life or afford groceries, your quality in life is not what it appears. Even if you can afford a larger home, paying extra on a smaller loan will get you that home ownership that much faster, freeing up money so you can enjoy life in the later years. So, in conclusion, the benefits of building a smaller timber frame home make it an appealing choice for home buyers and one that folks should consider. Now, if you'd like more information on small homes or you're looking for a plan, please come visit us at timberframehq.com. Take care and thanks for watching.